Oh, hey everyone. So, with Zorgarab coming out in Classic WoW, I thought I would actually have a little look at the place with my old character. Now, I haven't actually streamed or recorded anything with this character, um, as far as I can remember, but um, I do actually have, yeah, level 120 warrior, and I've done quite a lot of stuff, but to be honest, since Classic came out, I've not really bothered very much with um, keeping my character up to date, so I'm sure the um, armor's all laughably out of date. But uh, yeah, this is the entrance to Zorgarab, right? So let's look on the map. This is obviously the new map um, since the Cataclysm, but it's um, actually kind of the same in retail, so... Um, well, it, it's very similar in retail. So basically, you're looking at some, um, yeah, Stranglethorn Jungle, okay, um, Stranglethorn Vale, and Zorgarab is just this um, area here, right? That's obviously the um, arena that's uh, not quite as large on Classic. But um, yeah, that's where it's located anyway, guys. So I used to do this back in Classic um, quite a lot. Um, honestly, like 15 years ago when Classic came out, I wasn't really big into Blackwing Lair or, or anything. I did a lot of MC and I basically had um, all tier 1 on my Druid. And um, I think we did a, a bit of Blackwing Lair. Um, let me just check that this is recording, guys. Um, you shouldn't have hopefully noticed anything. Yes, it is recording. So, um, yeah, let's have a look in Zorgarab and see if it brings back any memories. Oh, okay, so I'm inside. Now, as far as I know, this hasn't actually been updated, guys. So, this is going to be the same sort of raid as what it is in Classic. So, anyway, I thought I'd give you my um, sort of ideas and stuff um, about Z Zorgarub. Um, so, there's um, a very nice fishing rod um, sort of down to the left, which um, we sort of normally do near the end of a run, right? Um, Nat Pagel's fishing exterminator, and it's... Um, Quite a nice weapon, but I used to have it on my druid, and I always thought it was very cool, you know, to actually have um, sort of a fishing rod as one of your main weapons. Um, so the cool thing about Zorgarub is if you haven't been running um, Molten Core or Blackwing Lair an awful lot, right, this is kind of like a really good area where you can catch up and you can get some good equipment. Um, for a Fury Warrior like me, I think there's a few nice bits, but um, nothing too um, amazing. Oh, uh, you know just occurred to me I really should be riding I guess oh my gosh I can actually fly in this place well okay I'll just fly doesn't seem to be much um happening actually I, I hope everything's spawned in okay I mean there's no reason why it wouldn't um let me have a little look at the map okay well it appears I'm in the instance but there's like nothing really here kind of sucks so I don't know what the heck's happening actually guys um, well I guess you can get a good look at the layout anyway but I don't know why there's not bosses and stuff uh, raid difficulty mythic dungeon difficulty mythic I don't see why that would actually make any difference guys oh so this is kind of disappointing. But anyway, I guess I could show you um, the layout of the place, okay? So you would, um, yeah, generally just come straight down here, okay? Cross the bridge. There's a whole bunch of crocodiles and stuff who are going to be sort of um, attacking you. Um, I, To be honest, I haven't... I'll have a look at the world finder thing. See if I can actually... Oh. I haven't been here for so long, guys. Um... Right, dungeons. Specific dungeon. Um, do I even have access to the lower dungeons? I don't think I do. Well, that's really disappointing anyway. But anyway, I guess I could show you the layout of the place because I think it's fairly similar to this. This looks a bit more vibrant than I actually remember. Um, now, I think you can ride in um, Zorkarub anyway. But... Um, I think when we come up here before, there was all boulders rolling down, guys. And there doesn't seem to be many boulders now. Which kind of sucks. Honestly, I don't know why there's not creeps and stuff, but oh well. Um, okay.
Blizzard, what are you doing to me? It seems that the only use for this place is actually farming ex exotic pets. So what kind of pets do we have? Let me have a little look on the mini-map. Probably snakes. Oh, forest spiderlings, lizard hatchlings. Nothing that interesting. Well, this is some um, disappointing, guys. I'm so freaking sorry. You know, I was planning on doing this video and, um, you know, sort of actually running through it by myself and um, sort of showing you guys some really cool stuff. So if I remember correctly, I think this wall here um, shoots poison darts at you or something. Though, like I said, it's been a while since I've actually run this. Um, I also think I missed a boss area. So, um, you will kind of um, do this area first, I guess. Oh, this is going to be a really disappointing video. I'm so sorry, guys. But at least you get, um, like, a bit of a view, um, I guess. So, yeah, you run through here. I think up here there's, like, a big raptor or something. And, uh, you know, the raptor will kind of um, try to get you. Um, I'm sure there's some dudes up the top there who will try to kill you. Um, oh, this video is freaking ruined. Never mind. I guess it's kind of pretty. So, in here, I think there's some kind of insane dudes who have some kind of insane, like, ber berserker rage and stuff. So, um, yeah. I think we can get inside there somehow. Can't quite remember how. But, yeah. Um, I think that's actually one of the end bosses, actually. That could be her car. Or, no, no, her car's in the other place, isn't it? That snake thing. Sunken Temple, that's it. Um, so, yeah, these are just like dead ruins. I, I guess all, um, everyone just killed everyone in here and there's nothing left. Oh, retail! Such a freaking disappointment. It's like a freaking ghost town, actually. You know I can't even remember half of this, so this video video's useless. Ooh. Oh great, so it isn't even my own instant zone. is money friend Keep it real. <clears throat> so hi guys um basically i've kind of run through old zulgarab okay and i kind of told you some stuff about the place and now i've kind of run into another instance right which Kind of seems like this is um, the new Zorgarab. So again, I think the layout on here and the bosses are very different. So I was going to run through this one anyway, just so that you guys could have a little look. Because um, I think some of it might be uh, similar. But yeah, how freaking weird. So now there's the dead zone, right? And then there's this new zone. I'm not going to really bother with the quests because I doubt they're going to be of much use. So again, I, I can't... Oh, I don't know, guys. It's kind of weird. I don't know what I'm even doing here. 
if I'm drinking the brew, am I? Can I fly? That's the question. No, I can't fly. But I can just run through, I guess. Probably gonna have to edit the video now, but... Okay, there's a giant floating head. <laughs> okay, well that was weird. Giant laggy head. Hmm. Some trolls chopping a tree. Right, um, so there's the offspring of Gash Rush down there. Um, I think there's a big crocodile that drops uh, drops some cool stuff. I guess we could kill Gub. Ooh. It's got some stinky fish. Are we all fish? I don't even know. But, um, yeah, okay. This isn't the way we usually go. Um, this is layout is kind of similar, I guess. But, I don't know, it feels very different. So I think we're going back to the start there, guys. I love my pasty legs. I love this transmog, guys. <laughs> this warrior with his, um, you know, legs completely exposed. It's, I would like, like, bloody Wonder Woman, you know. <laughs> uh. Oh, guys, look. He's actually got that staff, which um, a lot of people had in um, WoW Classic, which I think drops from here. So, everything I'm just one hitting, obviously. Ooh. Nice hundred level twenty things. Too late for you. Too late. Too late for you. Nice. Okay, guys, I I guess this might still be a good video, you know, just if you're curious how to do this in uh, in retail, as they call it. Although, to be honest, I'm probably doing everything messed up. Um, I think I've done this in retail, but, you know, not for quite a long time, probably in a random pub or something. Can't beat your giant sack. My Merry Munchkin costume. <laughs> I'm just so ridiculous and powerful, guys. They just can't even hit me. God, I'm really out of touch with classic. I mean, with um, retail now. What are you doing? <laughs> just can't get over that, guys. You know, it's kind of like in um, World of Warcraft Classic, it's almost like you're at god level now, right? Oh look, this is similar to what it used to be, I think. Kind of reminds me of a Sonic um, game almost moving left and right through that. Yeah, this kind of vaguely reminds, well, it's kind of vaguely similar to um, the kind of Zorkarub I remember. I mean, the trolls were a lot bigger, though. I'm it's funny, I'm used to retail money, so this kind of stuff makes me, uh, you know, it's kind of crazy, but... It seems crazy, like I've got 10,000 gold, and that's probably nothing in today's economy. I need to get closer. Retail is quite a lot of money. <laughs> I'd probably buy the game for that. <laughs> for a auction house, maybe. So it sort of seems I'm singing some music, guys. Whoa! 
Oh, I don't know. This really didn't go as um, planned. Um, I mean, the difference between classic and this is immense, you know. Everything, everyone is sort of big and cartoony and a bit ridiculous. And, Defeat Bloodlord in Zulgarab on heroic difficulty without killing Okan. Wow, I just got an achievement, guys. Some heroic items. Pretty nice. Again, I've got no idea how much everything is like worth or anything. But can I get in here? Chug it away. Let me in. Ah. So it's kind of probably too much to expect for them to have um, not changed everything, you know. Um, but what I want to know is, right, why isn't there sort of more information about these giant trolls, which are, um, you know, what the heck are baby been eating to grow that big? You know, guys, I, I think I'll just move on, to be honest, but you get the idea. Um, ooh, that's cool. So when I've um, defeated the bosses, there's a little X next to them. Again, that's probably been in the game for ages, but I just haven't really noticed it. But I, I guess we could just go and um, see if we can just beat the other ones. Might as well salvage for video a little bit. Um, if you guys want to have a look at my warrior, like I say, I'm sure all of my equipment is embarrassingly out of date right now. Right, like you could probably walk up to some random mob and slash them, and you'd be getting better items than these. But um. I've got, yeah, I think that's a PvP item. Um, I've got no idea what that is. Um, but yeah, I, I guess you can have a little look. Lots of um, haste, I see. Um, oh, leech. Yeah, leech was very cool. So um, if you've got a lot of haste and leech and stuff in PvP, then it's actually kind of awesome because I can just literally run around causing so much damage. Um, and also as a fury war, you can just literally just heal yourself constantly. So yeah, I've had a few PvP battles where everyone's been running away from me. <laughs> These are just terrified. That was kind of weird. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I should really play this some um, play this game more. Ah, oh, guys, remember I said about the um, like fiery bits, right? Oh, the um, arrows that came out of the wall. Well, it sort of seems like um, there's fire coming out of the wall now. So that's kind of cool. What the heck? Cache of Madness. Grelek. Honestly, I don't really speak troll, but... Help, I'm getting too much heads. Too many heads, guys. <laughs> ah. Why is my game lagging? That's crazy, man. It's not much, but it's you guys probably saw that, right? Mm, burial. That's kind of freaky. Well, have I done the boss then? No, I haven't done the boss. Well, I've never actually been here before. So, uh, this is my first time. I do like the monkeys, though, even though they're a bit oversized. Um, God, I remember doing that... Uh, run with the monkeys and um, the barrels and, you know, the sort of Donkey Kong reference or whatever, and um, I forget what that was, but I did that so many freaking times, like I'm talking like hundreds of times. Well, that's a nice shield. Maybe this is the last boss, I guess. Maybe you've got to kill the rest. I honestly don't know. How the heck do I even get there? Well, we'll go around, I guess. How you doing, man? I'm doing fine, man. Thank you for asking. Well, I hope these aren't sort of done by percentage. No, I, it doesn't seem so. Ooh, sorry. You look like a boss. Oh. 
Ne? So what did my map say? It looked like I could actually get round there. But maybe not. I reckon. I'm out of range. Yes, I can get up there. I love warriors. We can get into anywhere. It's so freaking sweet. This probably isn't the proper way to go, guys, but I just thought... Ooh, look, there's another boss up there. Over there. Not going to get up that mountain. But yeah, the charge is so epic on warriors, guys. Oh, wait, away. I've still got my heroic leap. Oh, yeah, my freaking heroic leap. See, I love the heroic leap, too. Like, literally, um, a good warrior can pretty much get anywhere now. This dude's cool. Dude. I mean, okay, maybe the animation's a bit crazy. Climb? Yes, I want to climb on you. <laughs> Ooh, Maelstorm Crystal. I don't have any add-ons to tell me what things are worth. It's kind of bizarre. It's kind of crazy that in... Um, you know, I've actually got more, like, add-ons and stuff in uh, Classic than I do in, in Retail at the moment. I suppose you don't really need them so much in Retail. But I, I think I've got Deadly Boss Mod, maybe. Oh, it seems I haven't actually killed any of these guys. Well, I don't know, guys. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. It was, like, hard to get in that area, wasn't it? I could probably get up that temple if I just about manage. Well... It's called the Chitsun Itza, isn't it? Sort of the um, Mexican tem temple. Gold Zimbiwe, 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 Zimbiwe. Sorry about that, guys. I went sing. <laughs> right. Um, I want to jump down. Blizzard is so mean. Get out the way, mister. I'm not going to hurt your dogs. Oh, look at him. They're cute. Oh, they're jaguars. Yeah, so I think this is kind of similar to um, what it used to be anyway on um, Classic, except everyone's bigger and there's um, like a bunch more effects and stuff. I also noticed like nearly all of the stunts and stuff have been removed from the game because, well, that isn't actually true. I mean, um... There were a lot of um, stuns and things in the past, I guess. This body is useless. Yeah, I agree. It is pretty useless, guys. Right. Woohoo! I've done it. Okay, guys. I guess we're leaving now. Well, I tell you what, we're getting some transmog stuff, guys. Oh, gosh. A load of junk. <laughs> I should get that just for, <laughs> just for the laugh. Just for a laugh. I mean, I always like to transmog this way, guys. I don't know why. It just kind of looks cool, but... This, me lord. Oh, my gosh. What on earth? What the heck did I get bunny ears? Pirate hat. Are these the ones I've actually got? Okay, these are the ones I've got. I do like the bunny ears, though. Really? I can transmog so my head is a giant pumpkin, can I? Really, Blizzard? No, to be honest, I... My aim is to um, always try to get my character to be as naked as possible a lot of the time. And I think on my druid, I'm um, not entirely sure. I think I'm pretty... I can't remember if I transformed my druid recently or not. Um, I could go have a little look, I guess. Oh, better not quit, actually, in case it does something funny to me. Lord Zimbabwe. Lord Zimwe. Okay. It's not fast, honestly. 
So I miss these three guys, but I don't know how to get to them. Because that's how good the game is. Lots of junk up there. I'm just coming for the bosses, guys. Oh, oh I better go um, just avoid the junk, I guess. Devil's Terrace, ooh. Oh, there's some nice, um, pretty cauldrons here. <laughs> oh, he's defeated already. Okay, I vaguely remember you have to do something with the cauldrons, guys. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it isn't probably useful, is it? But... You do something here, guys. Ah. Retro ghost. I think you meant to avoid the ghosts or something. I think they move slowly. Yeah. Can't beat the old green Meccano strider, though, can you guys? Honestly, you know, actually, back in Classic, funnily enough... My um, druid had a green Meccano Strider too. I remember it took ages farming um, reputation to um, actually get it, but I was sort of really happy when I actually had it because um, it was really unique. Like, oh, oh, sorry, it would be gnomish reputation. Obviously, the um, dwarves actually have the um, rams, don't they? But yeah, sorry, <laughs> just getting mixed up there. But anyway, I don't know. I kind of like the old classic Meccano Strider. Just gonna run up, guys. Um, oh, I'm gonna attempt to run up, but fail. So again, I vaguely remember this being a really epic boss, where you've got to like, I don't know, control all the mobs who sort of run up and try to kill you and whatnot. Um, probably won't be that epic today, though. Ooh, he's a hard one. Oh, this is fun. So I gather we are meant to, like, avoid the big black blobs. Okay, sort of immune to uh, whatever it is I do. I uh, guys, I wish I could give you more like insight about what we have to do here, but uh, damage. Do I even have guns? Do warriors even have guns anymore? No, they, they don't have guns, do they? I've been playing too much classic, I think. Ah, um. So I guess I've sighted the boss, but I've got no idea how to finish it. Hmm. I mean, again, I think I vaguely remember doing this once. Um, your deceit is unforgivable, Jindo. You're, you spit in the face of a god. Yeah. God. Right. <laughs> Can warriors even do this boss? I don't... I don't know. That's a big guy. God, in fact, he's so big you can kind of see, like, you know, a lot of the texture's kind of got a bit strange on his body. You can kind of see the pixels there, so... 
Oh, this is tiring. I'm very tired of this boss. I might just leave it. Okay. I'll tell you what I'll do. Spirit of Hakar. Let me just Google how to do it. How to beat the spirit. To be honest, I like the original better. You know, in Santa Temple. Pull the spirit warrior to the platform, allow it to slam one party member and break a brittle barrier. Um, keep the spirit warrior within the slam debuff and get it. Uh, kill the chain before the slam debuff it expires if possible. Repeat with the next two chains. So pull a spirit warrior to the platform, allow it to slam one party member and break a brittle barrier. Okay. So you guys have got to slam me. Oh, this could take a while. Guys, I literally don't think I can get them to um, slam me or whatever. Oh. What if I strip naked? Ooh, hope YouTube doesn't censor me, but to her they won't, I'm joking. Uh, okay, uh, Oh, I can't even strip naked. Guys, I don't think um, they can slam me, so I think this is um, a write-off. Defeat 20 twisted spirits within 15 seconds during the Jindo encounter in Zulgarab on heroic difficulty. Wow, I did that. I'm gonna give up, guys. There's nothing keeping me here, so... The god can just, like, stay alive, I guess. three guys over there. Oh great, so I can't even ride my pony now. My Electro Meccano Strider. Oh. This is kind of rubbish. Uh, I'll tell you what I'll do guys, um, I've been recording for a while now and that boss, I think I'm too powerful to defeat it so I think the boss is effectively immortal. So I think I've messed up the game now, I think I've made the car, the, the sky god, the, the snake do kind of angry so I'm just going to go see if I can kill the last four bosses and if I can't then I think I'll just call it a day. But I really hope you found some value in this. Um, I mean, this was really unexpected for me, guys. I had no idea that this was actually going to happen. And I kind of miss the old um, Zulgarab, if I'm honest. So um, I'll try to get a nice recording of it when I actually run it. Um, if things go to plan, I should hopefully run it on Thursday. Um, but who knows, because I haven't actually signed up for it yet on my sort of guild thing. But maybe I'll go do that now or something. But, um, yeah, I hope there was some use in this. Um, even to show you how ridiculous kind of the boss is. Or whatever, but... I'm sure I went up there, yeah. If not, I don't know what I'm going to do. Am I just going to, like, teleport out? Where's my soul stone? If I even have one. Yeah, okay, well, I can teleport out if I need to. <laughs> It'd be kind of fun if the, um, if the boss just followed me, you know. Oh, like these giant purple things just followed me everywhere. I'm sure as soon as I leave, they'll stop. So I swear I killed the boss here. I don't know why it's not showing up on the map. I 
I guess it's all bugged. Oh, Blizzard, you made a bugged game. Matt dude's still over there, sort of doing his stuff. Oh, this is so buggy, guys. Ace of Magnus, blah, 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 I don't know. I don't like troll names, if I'm honest. I mean, three letters followed by an abbreviation or something and another three letters. I, I don't know. Oh, well. Anyway, guys, um, I'm just going to like teleport out because I don't know if there's much else I can do at this stage. So, thanks for watching. I'm so sorry for... um not actually showing you like something more interesting but hopefully we'll I'll get to see something more interesting fairly soon oh come on now oh, I can't even teleport out oh no this is stupid if I get undercover I wonder if it'll keep probably Teleport to my garrison, see if that's any better. Woo! And we're out. Haven't been to my garrison for freaking ages. <laughs> I tell you what, guys. Seeing as how you're here. Have a little look at... So I think I'm all fully upgraded on my old garrison. I spent quite a long time here, actually. No time for dallying. No time for Watch dallying. What? No, I don't want to do that. I'm on. I reckon they were probably done some time ago, guys. What do you think? Yeah, it's a great map. got 150 oil if I remember correctly oil was actually kind of a pain to get like I actually had to run a certain location to get the oil Ninety-four chance of success sounds good to me I'm just gonna do it randomly um, whatever No, too much oil. Well, okay, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Hope you enjoyed um, watching that, though. And let me know if you want to see more of this kind of content. And please like and subscribe for more. And you know what? If you actually, you know, leave a comment in the video, I'll make more content like this. Um, maybe I could even run a few more sort of classic dungeons or, you know, do some interesting stuff in WoW Classic. But, uh, yeah, speak to you soon and goodbye.